Burglars have been targeting Rancho Panasquitos in re recent months, breaking into homes and cars. 10 News reporter Steve Fiorina shows us why one family feels very lucky despite being victimized. Taylor Sexton arrived home alone to find evidence of a burglar at work, not outside, after she went inside. There were things on the floor and the closet door in her parents' bedroom was closed. Very unusual. She thought about checking the closet, but decided against it. I didn't want to go over there because you see all the scary movies and stuff, but I just thought I better get out. A call to her mother confirmed that thought. Run to safety. It sounded like it's dangerous. Get out of there now. That's all I could think about was just leave. Her mom and brother returned with her later armed with baseball bats, finding evidence that her suspicion of someone hiding was probably correct. At that time, they saw that more stuff had happened since I had left. Um, the closet door was open, the one that was closed originally, shut tight, was open, and everything from the shelves on the master closet was taken down, ransacked. Parts of the house were a shambles, but little or nothing was taken, and Taylor wasn't hurt. So I'm just so grateful. First, I was angry about the violation and, and feeling like somebody had been in this home, and then I'm just so grateful, most of all, that nothing happened, that everybody's safe. Safe, mm -hmm. but wary. The idea of what might have been stayed with Taylor. It's really scary, I guess, if I'm the only one home that comes home. I always kind of check and make sure everything's safe. Dozens of homes here have been targeted in recent months. CrimeMapping.com shows lots of notations recently. Yes, I'm really concerned about that. Steve Fiorina, 10 News. Now, a lot of those homes that have been burglarized are above or near canyons where it's a lot easier to sneak into a backyard.